moisturized. Are, 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 are you I'm ready honored. to talk about our main story today? I'm so, I'm so ready. <laughs> We're gonna talk about a VTuber who appeared one time, two years ago, and never appeared again. That is right, chat. They were here very briefly, streamed once, two years ago, and disappeared forever. Probably the most cursed VTuber I've ever seen in my life. You know oh, what I'm yeah. talking about, Mickey. I do, and I have to say, when I saw this on the news today, I was overjoyed because this is something <laughs> that I, sometimes I pull out of my brain and I start laughing at randomly, so it's oh, Exactly. It's so I forget about this person existing. But chat, this is the greatest mystery in all of VTubing. So today, chat, we are going to talk about the VTuber, Tony the Tiger. Yes, yes that Tony the Tiger. Yes, Tony, Tony the Tiger. Tony, Tony. The, the Kellogg cereal guy. <laughs> Tony the Tiger. That is right. Yes, there is a Tony the Tiger VTuber. I know it's hard to believe, but he's actually real. He came in with it like my dad did for milk and cigarettes, chat. He streamed and never showed up again. I was here when this happened. I was in the chat. I was watching this unfold. I don't know if there are words to appropriately describe what was happening because combined with what was happening on the screen, the chat, you had to be there. We're gonna dig into it because this has to be probably the wildest YouTuber debut I've ever heard I've ever seen. But on top of that, it's just a crazy story because they streamed once and they never showed up again. It's wild. We don't know what happened. We don't know if they're coming back. We don't know anything about this VTuber. Why they even decided to be a VTuber. Absolutely crazy. Yes. But Mickey, why don't you tell us about your experience with the Tony the Tiger VTuber? Oh, absolutely. So, you know, one day I was scrolling through Twitch and there it was. Tony the Tiger debuting. Now, you know, I thought this was a joke. No, this was real. This was funded was by the real. cereal. And there he was in all of his 3D glory for the great cereal bowl bringing in flesh tubers from all corners of the internet. What they didn't prepare for, however, was that the internet is degenerate and you can't see it here because the chat was filled, was filled with the <laughs> oh, most insane furry shrimping I've ever seen in my life for Tony. So much so that some of the streamers that joined him also partook. The poor man had no idea what he got himself into. He had no idea what yiffing was. He had no idea what pog champs were. <laughs> he but had there no idea. he was. <laughs> <laughs> it was probably one of the greatest cringiest debuts I've what? ever seen in my entire life. I mean, it was absolutely wild. And so today, chat, I want to show you of what happened with the Tony the Tiger debut. He held the cereal bowl where people, um, I guess they're playing Fall Guys, right? Doing Fall Guys. And it, it was kind of weird. Like he, he went on to like brag about his skills. He was kind of like making fun of all these people. It, it was just wild. It was just yep. a wild, wild thing. So I want to show you guys some of the stuff that happened with Tony the Tiger. I, but would love I feel like this just sums it up. If I had to give you one clip it's this. to sum up the, the debut it's this one this is like the tldr of the vibe exactly i would love a signed yeah. sweaty That's tony authentic. the tiger bandana you are great and you're my pog champs oh yeah that's right chat. <laughs> all of you down there who's the real pog champ for tony the tiger that's you <laughs> you live with that <laughs> <laughs> and you are my knowledge. little pog champ. <laughs> so what wasn't captured in this clip too, which is even extra funny, was after that guy asked for the sweaty handband, handband, headband, Tony was uh, a little flustered. I think that was. was the point that Tony realized what exactly he dipped his toes into <laughs> and yeah, that it I was a mistake. <laughs> I, you know, he's used to being bathed in cereal, but not in cringe chat. I mean, yeah. it's crazy enough that, you know, people were talking about us, right? Like, mm -hmm. like, look at his stats, right? <laughs> he peaked at 14.5 thousand viewers. Yeah. I mean, he, he had a good debut chat. He was killing it out there. But we're going to go check out a video and it just... I don't know what to say about this. Like, sometimes I feel like you shouldn't be a VTuber. And yeah. Tony the Tiger... <laughs> was exactly that for me. Oh, yeah. Yep. 
It, it was something, chat. I mean, look, we can go take a look here at, at some of these other clips that are on his channel because I, I think they're pretty cringy, if I remember right. <laughs> and like, yes. I, he's just trying to keep up with it. I feel so bad for him. Oh, the poor man. I hope for he got reveals. paid. Somebody asked for a paw reveal, so uh, here's a little wave. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> you you know why they wanted to see that paw. You oh. know why. Oh my god. Oh this no. Poor this poor guy. Linda from Legal would be mad if I, I didn't mention that you probably shouldn't put milk in your liquid cooled PC. That is for tigers only. <laughs> and uh, also don't drink liquid out of your cooling tubes or e <laughs> even put it on your cereal. <laughs> what? <laughs> don't the well, what is this? Hey, everybody, it's me, the anthropomorphic tiger, serial mascot, now VTuber, Tony the Tiger. I'm back. I'm back to <laughs> hang out with you, the internet. <laughs> I'm flattered. I mean, just, oh. just imagine tuning in and him going, I'm back to hang out with you, partner. <laughs> oh, God. Also, I want to point this out. Something that really disturbed people when this debut was here was Tony the Tiger, the VTuber doesn't have ears. They are only on his headphones. Right, he exactly. Is That's such a good point. I forgot <laughs> about that. I love how he has like this like jacked up PC. Why does he need that? And it's supposed to be milk in the tubes, but everybody <laughs> thought it looked like something else instead. <laughs> Not the coom tubes. It's the coom tubes. <laughs> the coom tubes. Oh no. A lot of you have said that you like me. And a lot of you told me that you really, really like me. Oh no. You're here. <laughs> oh, I don't it, care if you've got skin or scales or fur on your tails. No, if you're stop. friends with snails or bark at the person who brings the mail, you're welcome here on my stream. <laughs> bark oh, at the no. person who brings the mail. Bow's like, bark, 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 bark. I am proud to call you my fans. And with you here oh, supporting no. me, I know I'll be the best tiger I can be. So, oh, no. welcome. Enjoy. Keep it family friendly, but most importantly, have fun. Yeah, okay. <laughs> oh, they did not. And with that, <laughs> I welcome you officially to the first ever Tony the Tiger Twitch stream and the inaugural Great Cereal Bowl of Greatness. What, why great why did Kellogg's Why did Kellogg's think this was acceptable? Who sat at the table and was like, all right, Jim, Tony the Tiger, but a VTuber. And everybody was like, Yes! Yes! Also, let's have something milk themed in the space like VTubing. <laughs> because as nothing can very, go wrong. As somebody who's very milk themed, I will tell you, chat, it's a two-sided coin for sure. <laughs> <laughs> I so wish we could still see the chat because there were certain parts where the entire thing was just like, Hey yo, where'd that milk come from? Hey yo, oh. yif yif. Hey yo, what <laughs> Everybody happens? kept saying yif. It was yeah. so great. <laughs> so there is an awesome video chat of but somebody I... reacting to this debut and it captured okay, so here's most the... of the important stuff. So let's go take a look at this video because it's fantastic chat. I mean, it is just, it's perfect. Thanks. So uh, many. Tony the Tiger is now a VTuber. I, I can't believe they did this. I, I can't believe they subjected these four people to this. Oh my gosh, I forgot they had to eat cereal. Oh, and they, and they kept voting on random Somebody stuff. Somebody asked for a paw reveal, so uh, here's a little wave. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, your favorite cereal mascot, who happened to be thirst bait a few years back, is returning to the social media platform. Well, why out of everything they could have put that they decided Tony the Tiger? As a VTuber. You know... That's a great question because, especially in a corporate environment, nothing screams like it would have been a good idea. Like, it, it just, nothing, exactly. nothing could have gone right if they had any ounce of research into this space, into this genre. It, there was just no way. So I, I really don't understand the decision. Whoever was in charge of this, I, I swear I could do better if you pay me even half. I swear I could do better. Seriously, like, whoever they hired for the 3D model even two years ago, like, I, I know that you might be, like, a fan of Vroid and maybe you love Vroid, but we could have done better Wish than this. that wasn't real, <laughs> but it is. For those that don't know, Tony the Tiger has become a VTuber on Twitch. They're the live stream last great. month as their sort of attempt to return in the spotlight as a social media personality. 
As most oh, of you God. hopefully remember, Tony has There's had- so many ways to enter a space. Then VTubing. Well, why VTubing of all things, chat? <laughs> Where they're like, yo, Tony the Tiger belongs there. Yeah, you know, I can't wait to collab with Tony the Tiger in my next charity stream. Yay. <laughs> Yay. Had an interesting past with well, who's um, your dream thirst collab? trapping on Tony Twitter. the Tiger. Well, furries and non furries alike thirsted him into submission, into eventually taking down his Twitter account. Remember how he was trying to they do the whole hip Twitter? with the kids personality thing? Oh, so yeah, that didn't they work. They even too knew well. about the, the furry stuff before it in the VTuber, and they still went ahead with this as an idea. That's what are you uh, thinking, Kellogg? They tried to sweep it under wow. the rug as if nothing what are you happened, thinking? hoping that eventually the internet would forget. Which, unfortunately for them, Tony the Tiger is, is Tony something the that tiger. the internet will never <laughs> forget. So here we are today with history somewhat repeating itself, this time in streamer form. If Tony the Tiger's a streamer, right? What is he gonna stream? That's such a good point. Could you imagine Tony the Tiger trying to play like Elden Ring or something when the hype was around right, that? Exactly. Like, <laughs> if he gets mad, is he just like, that's <laughs> Like, you know, is he just getting mad? Or is he just like, that's okay, we'll try again. Like, you know, like, what? how does he treat stuff? Me dying 462 times to millennia is great. <laughs> Exactly. I mean, maybe he'll do like a hot tub stream, you know? Maybe we'll get Tony the Tiger on the beach. Please, hot yes. Tubs. If you come back, Tony, if you don't do a, a milk bowl hot tub, I'm going to be disappointed. I'm going to be so upset if I don't get the coup. I, I mean, a milk uh, bowl hot yes. tub stream. Yep. Yep. For the milk tubes, uh, the tiger of course. Will be the milk tubes, on his yeah, first the milk stream tubes. As a VTuber mm -hmm. with a milk cooled PC setup. Milk cooling. What, why? You see, I know Tony's had his pack. Okay, so I know that you gotta have like themester stuff, right? Like the milk and stuff, but why did they do it with a PC? Like, that's not even like funny or creative. Of, uh, being nope. thirst baited into There's submission. No but um, nope. if I were to ever do a return to being a family friendly personality, I definitely wouldn't milk think cooling. to do a milk cooled PC. Honestly, Family I can't friendly, see this by the way. poorly at all. Like I know <laughs> they're so trying gross. to bring back Tony in a family friendly manner, but I don't in your PC. think that the milk cooling part Got really helps. The date for Tony's debut stream is this some goal to like to drink pilk? Like stream would be August 9th at 5 that? p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So you could expect every furry and their mother showing up to get some form of attention oh, from Tony. They or they were hoping to get some sort of reaction out of him based on the very interesting comments in chat. Because you know, like he's family friendly. So you want to avoid the degeneracy. So why did Kellogg's not look into anything and like block certain num like, not numbers, not numbers, but like words. I, I don't oh, understand yeah. their whole thought process through this. They went into this like a 13 year old that's never known about the internet with no internet blockers. They're just like, have fun. Oh yeah, it, it, it really is. Even in terms of corporate, because I used to work for a corporate company in social media and they are absolutely clueless despite pouring millions of dollars into it. It's insane how little they know. But even with that, they knew they had a warning when they had to delete his Twitter prior to this. You already have a flashing neon sign that you really need to do your research, that this is an issue. And at minimum, you need to block certain turns. And they said, with all of the resources, with everything banking on this, with their time and their money, they said, let's just slap this together. There's absolutely nothing that could go wrong. Like that is, that's really astounding. Even, even for a company, I feel like that is a surprisingly low bar. The, the ignorance is just absolutely insane. At oh, most, yeah. with mentioning of co-hosts and a tournament with the Battle Royale. But the only thing people would be going there for was Tony. And based on the preview I images mean, like of Tony's setup, of, like, this was going bowl. to be a wild mm, that's ride. That's a good idea. But was Tony's debut stream as chaotic and awkward absolutely. as we expected it to be? Well, let's go over it. Now, for the timeline of the live stream, it went on for about two hours, with the first 15 minutes being a countdown timer. It was, it was a, a big short reveal stream. of Tony the Tiger. Very I wasn't there that early so on, short. but you 
could only imagine how Twitch chat was going at that time. Everyone was hyped and ready, nearly 10,000 people in the stream, the chat probably flooding with eggplant emojis and furry yes. emotes <laughs> yes. and, and thirst bait messages and people yep. saying how much they've been inspired by Tony. This is actually a lot of insinuations. Chat. But nonetheless, that chat was yeah, probably it's not an, an exaggeration. But about 15 minutes into the stream, it actually starts with Tony Breed the Tiger me, coming Tony. in in all his glory. <laughs> and I'll give it to them. The VTuber model and setup is gorgeous. This isn't coming from someone who loves Tony, but just from someone who understands VTubing. The setup and art done for this is I mean, the background gorgeous. looks gorgeous. Like, whoever the Kelly Geyer to model and rig everything I don't, I don't in Tony's so setup, like, this oh, is the model level had ears, of Code though. Mika. I can't the get over it. The amount of detail and <laughs> the amount of responsiveness <laughs> and even the voice well, behind Once you see it, you can't unsee Tony. it. I don't know if it's yeah. the same voice actor in, like, the commercials for Tony, but it's spot on. And you recognize this within seconds. I have seconds. to say, whoever got, whoever they got as the actor, his voice was perfect, but I feel so bad for him because he clearly did not know oh, much yeah. about internet culture. Like, they just set him up just for absolute failure. No prep whatsoever. Like, I, I hope he got appropriately compensated for the mental anguish that this certainly caused. <laughs> Actually... Therapy. Oh my god. I definitely want to do this again in the future. You're using my crunchy, delicious Kellogg's Frosted Flakes. Yeah, it's Which, very on close. that note, Tony mm -hmm. makes it abundantly clear he knows what Twitch chat is up to. He knows the type of audience that is there, but obviously keeps it family friendly. He welcomes in his furry and non furry viewers. I'm flattered that a lot of you have said that you like me, and a lot of you told me that you really, really like me. Yeah. <laughs> he knew. He knew. Poor guy. Yeah, a lot going. of people do like you. But for the first five minutes, he just does <laughs> really, introductions really? about himself, talks about how he's Tony the Tiger oh. and his milk cooling PC. If that was the entirety of the stream, I'd be happy with it, to be honest. But no, this is Tony the Tiger behind the brand that is Kellogg and Frosted Flakes. So, therefore, every 30 seconds, you are going to hear something related to the cereal. We're going to answer the most important question yeah, in breakfast the history. Plugs. We're crazy. What comes first? The cereal or the milk? So first five Stream minutes, so far, burner. so good. How could this go possibly wrong? He goes on to announce that this is the first ever Tony the Tiger official Twitch stream and the inaugural and the great last. cereal bowl of greatness. <laughs> and the last. Which I'm assuming is the tournament that he's hosting and a play on the whole Super Bowl thing, but it's the cereal bowl. It, it's a Yay. solid idea. From a Who, whoever came up with that at, at Kellogg's, they cooked, okay? That was a good idea. It was. I wish they didn't call it the Great Cereal Bowl of Greatness, but the the Great Cereal Bowl, that would have been good. That, that, that That's that's solid. That's solid. Absolutely. Some of the things you'll pick <laughs> Thanks, up on Kato. immediately is that every single time he says great, he says it like great. And the inaugural great cereal bowl of greatness. A few of you probably saw this as trying to. I mean, that's hard. his, ta that's his it was tagline. He has to do that. You know, like he does have a choice of that. It's endearing yep. and sticking to the character through and through. So, hey, kudos to them on that. Tips, this stream was two years ago. And he has okay. disappeared. We have never seen him since. So far, we're off to a better start than Chester Cheese's stream. A few minutes in, he goes on to introduce the other Twitch streamers who will be helping him host this event. The streamers I've never in question heard of these are Chrissy, other four people, Big by Cheese, the way. and Gold Glove. It, it, it seems weird that they just found, it, it almost like, like, like C-roll, like Twitch stars, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. they just like kind of like random people. I agree. I also, like, he very clearly labeled himself as a VTuber in this stream. I'm a little right. surprised they didn't bring on at least one other VTuber. Right. Because they were clearly targeting that specific genre. He didn't have to call himself a VTuber, especially for a corporate thing, but he did. And so I, I find it a little weird that they weren't more amenable to the community and also asking them for feedback and bringing somebody on. Exactly. Like, it, it feels like, again, they went into a blind. They just found some random like uh twitch streamers that they, they really wanted it feels yep. like he's so disconnected from the vtuber community as a whole and the stream yep. just like represents that it's so crazy and he was in like the big gamer house with jericho and syndicate and team martin and he did the race yeah what, just what like at least been? one what VTuber. Been up to all this time you know as much as i don't know these streamers now i'm a little bit excited to see gold glove here because from what i remembered about him he was sometimes a smart ass in a good way so this was a little exciting for me i don't know the mm -hmm. other two so I, I can't really judge how they are on their streams or their character or whatnot but i know gold glove a little bit right off the bat one of the streamers makes a serial joke since it's a serial themed live stream one thing stays the same and will always stay the same 
guess what it is? Frosted flakes I are great. Which don't worry, there's plenty <laughs> more oh. of these. Oh, oh, that's great. Oh. Oh. oh, that's painful. That's. Oh, <laughs> you should know as part of internet culture that stuff like that, people pick up on it. It's not just like, oh, funny, haha, -ha, like, you know, little thing, right? Like, if you do right. something like that, people are going to literally go, that is so cringe. If you're going to do a plug, especially nowadays, you have to be smart with it. You have to be creative. Nobody, nobody is going to go for that. Oh, gosh, yeah, we can sniff. We can sniff the fake a mile away. Just... Yeah, That's we're, a we're sniffing it out, chat. Come. If you love them, <laughs> you're going to have a great time. They go on to do a bit of Q&A with these streamers, asking for streaming tips, showing off Tony's milk-cooled PC setup, because why Ugh, would you draw more so attention weird. to that? You know, true. I'm, uh, I don't mean to brag, but I'm kind of proud of my setup. What do you think? That's that's the greatest <laughs> setup I've ever seen on Twitch, and it's not even close. <laughs> Wait a minute. Tony, is, is that water He's laughing right too there? long uh, at the milk. <laughs> I, I like this. I like that he's proud of his setup, though. He's just like, no. hey, no. hey, I'm Tony, and uh, I, I got the milk setup. <laughs> Great. I love how it's like the next thing he really wants to ask, like, where do you think I got the milk from? <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead, ask. Oh, you don't no. really ask me. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, Jesus. Milk cooled PC. Custom milk? built. For all my Tony Even games. if you ignore the innuendos, how games? long until it spoils or curtains? <laughs> what are Tony games? What are Tony games? For all my Tony games. Do you have V2 for Tony games? It just sounds so sus. Like, I need my milk cooled PC to play Tony games with me. That's right. Games. Milk. You, you know, see games. where this is going. <laughs> And Tony, I see that you're sharing your uh, Steam library. <laughs> That's a lot of uh, H anime games. <laughs> Tony games, you know what I'm saying? Oh my gosh. I can't. I can't. I can't. My Tony games, I gotta make sure I got plenty of built chat, you know? <laughs> Never. We go on to talk about how his model can be rendered with his powerful graphics card. Just a simple flex, nothing big. And they continue introducing his cast of co-hosts. And that's really about it, just banter and questions. And this entire 15 minute bit is absolutely riddled with brand placement and, and jokes about cereal and greatness, especially oh. from the co-hosts. It's actually kind of uncanny seeing the streamers talk about it more than the actual mascot character in the stream. And that's sort of my little tidbit on this whole thing. I haven't seen any of the streamers. I feel like they literally set the stream up and they were like, okay, so your job as a streamer today is to plug Kellogg's in as many ways as possible in this uh, hour and a half like stream. Right? Because it's not a lot of time and they probably had like, okay, you need to mention it this many times. Just got to get yeah, it in. It's like, yeah, hey, I wild. woke up this morning, cereal, and then I went cereal and then I got to the shower to cereal and then I brushed my cereal. Oh, definitely. You know, I was really feeling lucky today because I had some lucky charms. Man, thank God, you know, without that, <laughs> that'd have been the worst. You know, an apple a day, I added that to my breakfast. Uh, apple a day keeps the doctor away. Just like Apple Jacks. Mm, I love those too. <laughs> like, <laughs> stop the plugs. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Outside of, of this event. So I can't really judge how their streams are, but I feel like a lot of what was being said in this stream was forced. There was actually a theory that I had that this was all pre-recorded before the stream itself and they were just playing a video just because of how like disingenuous it's very it robotic. felt. robotic. I know it's supposed yeah, to be a really family was. friendly stream for a, a very popular brand, but at the same time, I, I feel think like you, it could uh, cut the tension with the messages, knife. Right? Like the quips, Chrissy saying she loves eating cereal on stream, I which may or may so. not be- I, I can't remember though. Yeah, I thought I, he responded like a few things. I wonder if some of it, cause there was a part where he was by himself for a brief bit. I wonder if that was alive and maybe some of the other stuff was pre-recorded. Like I could see that maybe. Yeah, he did true respond to the, of the event. I mm -hmm. love true. eating cereal on stream. It's the perfect gaming snack. So I'm just, I'm happy to be here today. And overall, just being very pushy of the Frosted Flake cereal brand. Frosted Flakes. Yeah. It feels like they had a gun to their Which head. Again, They're just like, keep talking about Frosted Flakes. Oh my expected. gosh, so but it true. Just feels so disingenuous, to be honest. So expect this to be a, a norm in the street. Like, look, if you're going to promo something like a brand wise, especially if you're like Tony the Tiger, just like, I mean, you literally, it would have been better for you to be like, hey, look, I'm Tony the Tiger, the VTuber. Look, I know you know me for Frosted Flakes. Obviously, 
Obviously, I like Frosted Flakes. I'm sure you like Frosted Flakes. Here's a special code for 10% off or something. Like, let's play some games. Yeah, that would you know, have been, been so, so much better. better. Uh, they should have hired like, you, I think. Maybe every 30 <laughs> seconds or so. I mean, I got the milk. Oh, a joke is told. If they're not already talking the about something relating to cereal. <laughs> or Tony. Which, to be honest, we only really care about Tony here. After the introductions, Tony mentions how he's had different looks in makeovers over the years. So he asks the streamers and Twitch chat which Tony oh, the no. Tiger is their favorite. And Chris oh, starts no. to strong Wait, 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 wait. hot air balloon. Balloon? <laughs> I can't talk. Oh, I'm scared. And Chrissy starts things off strong by mentioning hot air balloon Tony. Tony the tiger <laughs> as an no. air balloon while a chat full of- Why are you gonna bring up anything that's to do with the balloon? <laughs> or inflation <laughs> or blowing? Thirsty furries is present. All right, so my favorite by far was <laughs> oh, when no. you were hot air balloon Tony. The best oh, part of this yeah. is that no. you're in the basket and the balloon. What can't you do and where can't he be? So just saying, Chrissy. Yeah, let's <laughs> no. Thank you. But the rest of them go on to talk about their favorite Tonys, like 80s Tony, 50s Tony, shiny Jesus. new Tony. And then eventually, they asked Twitch chat to vote on their favorite one out of the four oh. mentioned. Uh, can you guess which one of these won? I mean, some of you would think that shiny new Tony in all his glory would. No, it was hot air balloon Tony. <laughs> Furries love of inflation. Course. God. Of but obviously in the stream, there was no insinuation of- Even of the YouTuber knows. He's like, yeah, furries love inflation. Free related nonsense. It was just <laughs> Twitch chat that was absolutely going off as soon as hot air balloon I Tony can't. was mentioned. I think it's I saw a couple of my inflated big round emotes in that chat which thank oh you to whoever God. did that a hot air balloon <laughs> tony of all the different rebranded versions of tony the first one that is mentioned is hot air balloon tony i know chrissy meant well <laughs> but i don't think it's said a thing i mean okay honestly like if i'm thinking of anything out there and i'm a guest streamer i'm gonna look right. at this and go you know what i shouldn't mention anything that could be taken sexually so i'm gonna do everything possible but literally she goes you know what i'm gonna think of the most degenerate innuendo that i possibly could and then and then she she goes with where can't he be and what can't he do what can't he do indeed when it comes to furry art <laughs> i would love to know i'm just kidding i don't want to know i already know too much but you <laughs> my point still stands things up in a good way for tony to be reading chat if he was reading chat which maybe he was or maybe he was oh being sent God. certain ones but either way the only notable thing that happens after is they continue to compliment vtuber tony which honestly who can blame them he looks great more jokes about frosted awesome. plays being great, <laughs> great like tony and a couple of other highlights and, and things that tony said out of context, that doesn't sound great. Like, I knew you had it in you. I knew you had it in you. Got that one out. <laughs> the next thing they discuss and vote on is which came- <laughs> His laugh is so creepy. Oh, <laughs> Stuff like on. that. He's just like- <laughs> <laughs> Milk PC. <laughs> Do you want to see where the milk comes from? <laughs> I wanted this to be family friendly and it just came off so not. It was so it's it's just not. It's just not. Uh, now I see why he never came back. It's it's all making sense now. Came first, the cereal or the milk? Yes, that was an actual conversation they had. We're going to answer the Wait, most what? important question in breakfast history. Oh boy. What comes first? The cereal? or the milk. Tony also said, cast your cereal. vote in chat by using the PogChant emote for milk and Kappa emote for cereal. Cast your vote in chat by using the PogChamp emote for the milk. The streamer is saying no. For cereal. Whoa, 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 wait, he said PogChamp? Gold Club is like, no. I was, yeah, I was gonna say, Gold Club, they literally paid this man to be on this stream. And even with that, he still cannot help himself from viscerally reacting to the cringe that he sees going on. That's how bad it is. Oh my god. It, it's so weird too, because like hearing Tony the Tiger of all people say Hog Champ and Kappa, like it just, it just, oh, it doesn't sit well. Yep. 
He said the thing, he's being relatable. You know that when there's an out of touch yeah. brand trying to be relatable, That's they'll true. always say PogChamp, just like Chester That's true. did. At some point in a brand's career, they say PogChamp. The next few minutes is the usual banter, except it feels like everyone's walking on eggshells. Everyone trying to keep things family friendly. Oh, no, Chrissy, which I don't know Chrissy how many of the streamers it. here <laughs> are had family the friendly outside of this event. I can guarantee not too many, which is absolutely understandable. But you know, mm, mm. And finally, they announced the tournament that they have, which is sponsored by Kellogg's Frosted Flakes. But what wow, is what the big surprise. tournament they have planned? They play Fall Guys. They play three games and get points for how far and well they compete, and the highest score wins. What do they win? Who knows? Oh, except there's one Frosted problem flakes. here. Uh, Tony doesn't play in this tournament. In fact, he doesn't play at all in this stream. They actually sub in some other streamer named Cleo. Okay, that's kind of weird, actually. Why did they do that? It was, and if I'm remembering it correctly, like for this portion, he wasn't even there commentating or anything like that. Like it, he was just gone, like straight up gone. That Thomas is so to strange. take Tony's place in the tournament. We all came here to see Tony the Tiger. Yeah, you came to see Tony. To fall, guys. So why did they just like remove Tony from the game? Well, the chat is For flooded real. with eggplant emojis and furry gasm emojis of every kind, and, and some donation text to speech going yeah, on in the weird. back, going l l l l l l l l l. I wanted chaos. <laughs> so after 15 yeah, minutes exactly. of introductions, we're like 30 minutes into the stream. Tony leaves, and the event turns into streamer friends playing Fall Guys, and this goes on for about an hour. And all that well, happened wouldn't throughout be that here? time were yeah. the streamers talking about how good they were at Fall Guys. I, Don't I, take I, the I was hoping to hear like, uh, you know, him like fuck up or something. And then just one of the other streamers were like, wow, Tony, you suck. <laughs> like, you right? know, like just go you after him. Because you didn't drink enough milk today to be prepared for the, uh, the tournament, Tony. <laughs> like I would kill anything in the world just to hear Tony the Tiger look at his fellow streamers and go, well, that's a skill issue. <laughs> Looks like you're gonna need more Riz in order to get <laughs> to win this competition. Oh my god. This the wrong way, any of these streamers. But I don't care to watch them when I'm on a Tony yeah, the I'm Tiger stream. Yeah, I want to watch Tony. I'm not there for you guys. Especially his debut. I'm gonna be honest, it was the most boring thing I've ever watched. Which, yes, I love is the, a I tournament, I love the, uh, man. The, the Kellogg's Frosted Flake in the corner. understand there's competitive Just in case you other forgot. People want to talk about how good they are <laughs> and they're trying to win. But, like, I am here for Tony the Tiger. Now, I'll give credit where it's due. Gold Glove is a natural, and he's just as I remember him from all those years ago. And, and he did You're pretty great. I'm going to be honest, he was very entertaining. <laughs> and all the streamers genuinely tried <laughs> to keep the hype going <laughs> while Tony was gone until he showed up again. You know, I could have hoped for a little bit of, like, Twitch chat interaction. Granted, you probably didn't want to do that at all. Or maybe them talking about, you, you know, anything I but it. Fall Guys. I can only imagine yeah, what, like, the limitations were that he could or talk, talk about, about Fall Guys. I want to talk about Tony during the that hour. It might have been boring <laughs> to my standards and it might not have applied to any of the current audience watching, but for no, what Twitch they were required to do, the streamers 100%. did it good. And I will give them that because honestly, if I was in that situation, which granted will never happen in a million years, I would have said and done the same exact thing. I would have just been sitting there talking about, wow, I got second place in, in this round in Fall Guys. Let's go! <laughs> Hype! And I wouldn't have been allowed to even mention exactly. chat in the slightest, knowing how chaotic it was throughout the entire, like, two-hour period. So I will give the streamers that. They did the best that they could, they the probably best under the could. circumstances oh, that yeah, they were allowed to. The tournament itself went on for about an hour till Tony came back to announce the winners. In fact, Tony was being summoned back to the stream by everyone in chat going pss, 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 like the noise you make to call a cat over. I'm glad that furries That's decided hilarious. to act as some sort of hive mind that day. Chat was my favorite part of this stream. stream as amazing as it was. And it's a shame that we don't have the chat logs from that stream. You know, for once, yeah, this is probably something furries have done right. But before they announced the winners it had been roughly 30 <laughs> seconds since they had last mentioned cereal or frosted flakes of any kind so you know what time it was it was time for an ad that break time, and baby. this in my opinion was the best part of the entire live stream instead of rolling Yo, ads really? on a twitch stream they decided to just take a break and eat some cereal so all the streamers got out their bowls Wait, and milk what? and they're conveniently placed in front of the camera frosted flakes boxes while tony performed so ASMR natural for everyone there. Let me repeat Wait, that. Wait, he performed, he actually did the ASMR? Oh, 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 Kellogg. Oh, no. Kellogg, oh, God. Why? 
Vicky, I feel like we should stop here. I'm scared. Oh, we might have to go find the clip. Oh, here he goes. Trust fall into a tasty Frosted Flakes strawberry milkshake. It's got your back. Hear yes, the it crunch. does, Tony. Be the crunch. Mm. Pour yourself a bowl of Frosted Flakes chocolate. Your reward? Bonus chocolate milk. Ha, ha, ha. Bonus milk. I cannot. <laughs> Our delicious flavors oh, oh, of Frosted oh, oh, Flakes. Oh, I'll hug you. Chocolate. I'll hug you until it's over. Strawberry milkshake and cinnamon French toast. Hold on. I'm, I'm going gonna, gonna to go back a little bit. Because... Sponsored. <laughs> Why are they showing him? I can't hear my why are they showing him orgasm of her eating the cereal? He mm. literally said Pour an yourself ASMR a bowl hashtag of frosted sponsored. flakes chocolate. Your reward? Bonus chocolate milk. <laughs> Bonus milk. Oh no. By the way, <laughs> that's iconic. Try our delicious flavors of frosted flakes. Chocolate. Like it crispy. Strawberry milkshake. <laughs> Can I get and that? cinnamon French toast. Extra milk. Hashtag <laughs> sponsored. No! Look at look at <laughs> I can't hear my Sounds. own chewing over. Why did they show him fucking orgasming over eating cereal? I don't like this. Not Hashtag that. sponsored. My oh, God, bonus yeah. PC cool want... milky mil milkies. I, milk. I mean milk is hashtag sponsored. Get some of your ASMR crunchy cereal dipped in my milkies today. Bonus milk. Oh God. Cinnamon French toast. <laughs> Hashtag sponsored. I can't. Like, I like, oh. Can't. Mm. oh, yeah. Stop. I can't hear oh, my yeah, chili over here. Yeah, Tony, give me your milk. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and I, 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 this, I, oh, it, oh, it's, oh, the, it's just painful. It's pain. It's, it's painful. <laughs> Do you think when Tony finishes, he says hashtag sponsored? <laughs> No, 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 he goes, he goes, that was great. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. You're chewing. I feel like you're so chewing good. for me. Wait, 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 wait. Listen to his creepy little laugh. Mm. <laughs> Listen to his little laugh. I can't hear my Sounds own chewing so over your chewing. <laughs> I feel like you're so chewing good. for Tony, me. Stop. I feel like you're chewing. He's like, it sounds so delicious. <laughs> Tony, please. Oh, yeah. No. Just remember. No. You're great. No, stop. He did it. He did the you're great. No. Well, that was fun, wasn't it? <laughs> the results are in. And original Frosted Flakes was your favorite. He's literally like, oh, yeah. Chew that cereal. What oh. a good hog chip. Oh, gosh. Oh. Oh. Oh, my I'm, God. I need therapy. <laughs> well, I'm going to press play. I'm going to keep going, Mickey. I'm going to keep no. going. Do it. Do it. But mm. trust me, they are all <laughs> No wonder winners. he didn't come That's back. That's right. Oh, gee. That's right. Oh. <laughs> oh, gee. Classic. That's true. Great. Gotta have it. Very true. Oh. That was a much needed break, Tony. Thank you for that. <laughs> <laughs> Appreciate you. I know you get hungry playing. You got to have a little little cereal break there. No, stop! Yeah, that, that was, was really working snack. up an appetite. <laughs> Is that what we call it? A little cereal break chat? You know, a little milk break? He makes, he makes it Do you all, all remember so that fun. cereal versus milk debate <laughs> it does. that we had? Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, I remember. Now, it's so sussy. You all wrote in chat the pot emote for oh. milk or kappa emote for cereal oh, well no. if you voted earlier you'll be entered to win a free box of frosted flakes signed by all of us you'll get oh. a whisper if you won <laughs> that is literally whisper. the worst prize of all time <laughs> who oh, wants I, that i want the bandana instead i don't want the cereal box so true i want the sweaty bandana mm -hmm. <laughs> You know, I don't know if I want Tony <laughs> whispering me. I'm just gonna say. I know. Oh. That's pretty cool. Hey, look. I got oh, he frosted your flakes. 
<laughs> like, oh, we know he frosted your flakes. Chrissy and Big Cheese are still on Damn their uh, cereal break oh. here. That's good. Tony, I'm can I ask you a question? The break is... Absolutely, oh, Cleo. No. What's up? So, you're streaming. You have an incredible setup. I am setup. streaming. This is your Thank first you. one. You got a chance to have four incredible oh, guests no. be a part of the cereal bowl. So my next oh, question no. to you would be, when are we get a chance to see some like emotes, maybe some mm. uh, maybe some cool notifications, you know? Oh. Is that also oh, the future seven. for you know Tony the Tiger's Twitch channel? Yeah, give me a little time to get used to this streaming first, and we'll see what what I can uh, what I can. And manage he never here. came back. He was like, you know he what? Never <laughs> did. I'm out. Oh seven. All right. All right. I think we've seen enough of fucking Tony the Tiger. Oh, what a what a trip! Oh my gosh! Oh my god, uh, Mickey, let me ask you. Yes. Do you think Tony will ever come back a after watching all of this that has gone down? Do you think that he will ever come back? I don't think so. It's been two years. I don't think anything will be as iconic as the debut anyway. If he did somehow come back, I don't know if there would be any way for them to do this as a corporate, like, serial company conglomerate, but if they leaned more into the VTubing community and what that demographic actually is, and like gave them freedom to meme about it a little bit. I think it might be a little bit better for them. That being yes. said, I don't think Kellogg's has the acumen to do that. I'm sorry, Kellogg. Just looking at this, I don't think it's there for you. But if you did, if you did figure it out, I think, you know, if you came back with that mindset, it would be a lot better. This has to be the wildest VTuber debut that's probably ever taken place. I really cannot think of something that is just crazier than this chat. This has to be not only the craziest VTuber debut, but probably the worst. Oh, I, probably yeah. the like least successful one I've ever seen. So, so much money went into this and for them to get this out of it where there's never streaming again, they never wanted to do it again. Like it, for them, the perception must have been so bad. They were like, no, we're not gonna ever do this again. You know it was super rough, chat. I mean, that's actually kind of crazy. I agree. I agree. Uh, yeah, definitely the strangest conceptually as well. Like, you know, there are a few like really, really good debuts I can think about that I've seen. Um, none are as iconic and stuck into my brain like this one. It's not necessarily a good Absolutely. thing. Absolutely. But it is there. Yeah. <laughs> it, this, this, this might be the most confusing and infamous VTuber debut of all time. Mm -hmm, uh, so mm -hmm. it's been two years, chat. We don't know where Tony is. We're still waiting for him to come back. So Tony, come back, <laughs> please. <laughs> yeah, give him the, give him the. <laughs> come Sorry, on, uh... come back. D yeah, get, do a, do a, start a social media campaign. Hashtag bring Tony back. Hashtag. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs>